What's going on guys? Welcome back to Jungle to another video and today we are with the Atlantis Blue F80. I cannot believe we have this car in our possession. I'm just so, so, so blessed waking up every single morning and just seeing this car outside and I just have you guys to thank for that because honestly, I still just cannot believe we have this car. I absolutely love this car. You guys can even see inside the garage how beautiful this thing is. Normally cars inside the garage look terrible. But this one, just the angles and everything, it just looks like kind of like an ocean vibe. Absolutely love this color. I don't know if you guys know who Dubsest is. He's a guy on Instagram that posts a lot of beautiful pictures of an Atlantis Blue M3, and it's absolutely gorgeous. And I only dreamt of owning that car. I can only imagine how expensive it was. And I was like, you know what, honestly, I, I, maybe I'll just wrap it in some teal color and it'll be close enough because I know my broke self cannot afford one of those. But then an opportunity came for this guy and I just had to get it, especially when I found out it actually had the red interior in the manual gearbox. Like I honestly don't know how I got that lucky and I, I'm just, again, so blessed, so happy. It has comfort access, the carbon roof, and it's just very well taken care of by my boy Nick. My boy Nick has had this car for a while now, and he's taken just such good care of it. Like, just look at this thing. Oh, my Lord. But you guys know me. I can't keep a car stock. Shout out to Nick for actually putting some Michelin tires on me. Michelin Pilot Sports. Um, So, like, man. Oh, Michelin Pilot Super Sports. Nick, bro, like, what are you doing? He actually had some aftermarket wheels, some Vorsteiners, and uh, he decided to just put back the stock ones um, to get me a better deal because, you know, my broke side. It, it, yeah, long story short, Nick again helped me out and he also wrapped it with some Michel Pilot Super Sports which, you know, myself, if I was selling a car, I would have put some, um, let's just say it wouldn't be Michel Pilot Super Sports. A huge special shout out to Nick. He also got the original rims which are super, super, super nice. I'm not the biggest fan of them, but they are some of the best tires and wheels that you guys can take on the track. So. Definitely something I plan on doing with Blake. I promise Blake I'm gonna be taking this car with him onto the track. I do need to put a full clear bar to the front end just to make sure this paint is protected. And then after that, obviously, we're taking it out of the track, enjoy it a little bit. I need to get a helmet, a couple other things. Um, but oh my God, I need to make sure we protect this paint with all costs because this is the reason I purchased this car in the first place. Guys, I, oh my God. I, this is like the fifth or sixth day that I've owned this car now and I, I just still cannot fathom how beautiful it is. I, oh my God, I, uh, everything happens for a reason guys when I totaled the M4 I thought that literally my luck was just gonna go down from there and especially with the 7 series and the M5 I thought nothing is gonna be able to bring back my mood But this car reminds me of when I first started YouTube and how much fun it is to actually modify a car that I truly love And oh my god guys this car is one that's the exact definition of a car I truly love so the first mod you guys saw is that I got this M3 plate I actually bought this from BMW a long long time ago for my E92 M3 but ended up selling it So I never actually put it on and I said one day when I actually get another M3, I'll slap on those plates. They just look so good with this blacked out M3 emblem. So I'm super happy about that. The next thing is we're going to need a spoiler and uh, we need some more carbon fiber. I love carbon. It came with the carbon roof. It actually came with these OEM carbon side mirrors, which looks absolutely stunning. And they match the exact same weave as the roof. Nick actually added those on. So huge special shout out to him. Just got the engine bay open just because I want to show you guys the carbon. Just, oh my God, I cannot get enough of this color. It's just so gorgeous. I want to go ahead and just make this like full show car worthy and track worthy and everything. I want to get like the beautiful, you know, cover for that. I want to get the, 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 the like dressed up hardware. I want to get like carbon fiber intakes. I want to get like a nice CSF cooler or maybe even a burger tuning one or something. Like this is just hideous. It's so ugly. I need an upgraded cooler for sure. And again, just more carbon fiber stuff here. Might even upgrade this to the upgraded, uh, the cooler right here. Change this out for sure. A lot of upgrades to the engine bay. We, again, we have so many plans for this car, guys. I don't know if you guys know, but my favorite color is blue. And uh, that's why I painted the E92 M3 blue. At this point in the video, guys, I did want to show you guys some carbon fiber, but before we do, I need to give you guys shout outs because you guys absolutely destroyed the merch drop. So let's go ahead and cut it to future Nora when he actually gives you guys a proper shout out for all the support you guys have given me and actually cop the new Atlantis blue merch. I think the thing that's selling at the fastest guys are these air fresheners. So if you guys haven't caught them, make sure to do so because once these sell out, that's the end of that. I'm actually keeping 10 for myself because I know I'm gonna need them and they're just so, so, so nice. But yeah, future Nora, take the camera. First things first guys, let me go ahead and fuel up because uh, yeah, I'm, <laughs> your boy's running empty. Zero funds? Okay. Um, uh, that's it. Yeah, no, I was just wondering what's going on with my funds. It's saying I can't, I don't have anything, like, like I can't fill up. Is that, is that true? Yeah, like I know I've been broke for a minute now. I mean, after getting this car, I knew things are kind of rough, but I didn't think it was going to be that rough. 
Yeah. Oh, I'll actually have funds tomorrow? Why is that? Why Why is that that I have funds tomorrow but not today? Like, <laughs> I didn't do anything. Really? Wow. Man. Wow. God bless. That many people? What? I, I gotta thank them somehow. Um... Okay, I think I, you know what, I think in the next video, I'm going to go ahead and just put up all their names on the screen or something, just so, wow, that's a lot of people, wow. They got all the merch, too. Oh my god, I, I don't even know what to say, god bless them, honestly, like, oh my lord, so tomorrow I'll be able to fuel up, and get some carbon fiber, oh, I can't wait, I, yes, we'll be able to get some good content out, get some gas in the car, god bless, god bless, all right. Yeah, no, I'm gonna, I'm gonna, I'm gonna personally make sure I thank these people for supporting because, oh my God, God bless their souls. Okay, all right, cool, cool. Thank you, thank you. Bye. All right, so camera recording. Hey guys, what's up? What's up? So uh, I just found out that uh, you know you you guys have been absolutely supporting the channel and copping the merch down below. So you know what? For all of you guys who actually cop merch and supported the channel, I just want to put all you guys' names there for a minute. A lot of you guys cop merch, and if I was to sit here, I can make literally a dedicated video saying all of you guys' names. I remember the days that I used to literally sell merch, and you guys, I get like maybe five people, maybe two people, and I'll be able to say your names in the video. But now there's so many of you guys, and I really just thank you guys so much for the opportunity. And I'm just so 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 excited for more mods and stuff like that on the car. And again, thank you guys for supporting the channel. When I do big things like this, I really 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 hope that you guys will actually like it because if you don't it's just gonna be a little rough <laughs> but I mean I, I really appreciate it and I'm happy you guys like this build as much as I am I saw the comments I saw the feedback and again shout out to everyone right here for cop and merch if you guys let me shout out in the next video and I'll make some other cool little skit for it make sure to check out that first link down below pretty much the Atlantis blue merch pretty much everything is like more than 50% gone we still have a good amount of i8 stuff but if you guys really want to get the Atlantis blue merch the keychains and the air fresheners those are all pretty much more than halfway gone so if you guys want to cop those there's a limited time and they're gone forever so make sure you check out that first link down below. Without further ado, guys, let me get you guys back to the future so you guys can enjoy the carbon fiber installs. Now that we are back, here's my boy, The Odd, just chilling like a villain. How's everything going, my dude? I can't wait to put on the carbon fiber. <laughs> so good on bro, it's gonna, I mean, we already got the carbon mirror caps, the carbon roof. I mean, this is gonna look so good, bro. Especially with the interior, dude. Like, the interior dude looks amazing, but imagine some more carbon. I thought when you said carbon, you meant like side skirts or like front bumper. We don't have that just yet, but we plan to. This is this is more of like detailed stuff, you know what I mean? But yeah, guys, this all came from Keys Motorsports. So huge special shout out to them. Again, I have a discount code with Keys Motorsports. These, I'm pretty sure, are priced the same everywhere. And if you use my discount code, you guys can get these for even cheaper. So remember, guys, use code NOR5 for anything from Keys Motorsports, and you guys will get a discount and you'll be supporting the channel at the exact same time. But yeah, guys, look at these carbon fiber back covers. Now, obviously, this isn't no G80. The G80 is an absolutely stunning. They have the most beautiful seats in the world. These are honestly beautiful. I love them. I wish they had the cutout. They don't, but it's all gravy in the Navy. It's still the amazing Sakura orange interior. Just absolutely gorgeous. Like, it's still so stunning. Honestly, having the carbon fiber backs right here, just gonna look so, so, so good. Especially for people in the rear. At least they get some carbon fiber going on. Uh, oh my God, guys. These, even these seats just look just so stunning. I'm just, I can't get over how beautiful this car is. I don't know if I showed you guys this either, but it's got heated rear seats. Like, sheesh. I'm <laughs> just so excited, guys. But yeah, we got some carbon fiber covers for the rear seats, which is pretty awesome. And then even for the rear seats back here this little section right here we actually have some carbon fiber covers as well so it makes pretty much all the seats have some carbon fiber rear covers it looks super good and then last but not least um this actually i got a long time ago from keys motorsports and i decided not to return it because i i was like one day i'll get an f80 like i knew it for sure one day i'll get one i just didn't think it was going to be that soon so i actually ordered this and uh for the m4 and i didn't realize the m4 and the m3 were different so i got the m3 and look at that like everything happens for a reason guys we kept the spoiler and now I'll be able to take off this spoiler and replace it with a better one. I actually have the proper tools on how to remove a spoiler and how to clean off all the gunk. So I'll be showing you guys how to do that in the video as well. Because I found this new technique that you guys are honestly going to thank me for. Like, trust me on this. Without further ado, guys. Are you ready to help me, bro? Are you ready to do? Ready to get some carbon on this beast? Oh, my God. Oh, my God. Just take a look at it. Just take a look at it. Just take a look at it, bro. I need, I need, I need a garage. No, no, no. You got to sit over here and take a look at it. Oh, okay. From over here? Yeah, look at the light. Shit. 
Sheesh. Oh my lord. We have to get this out for you guys. As soon as we get everything installed, I'll get you guys a little cinematic. But without further ado, let's go ahead and get into it. Just keep it down, down inside Yeah, you and I Both longing for expression For the things we like But we stay quiet Hold me now, hold me now Tell me things, tell me all about How you feel Just let yourself go Say it loud, say it loud Break the world on the other side Make it real Just let yourself go you chillin'? We're going to Avenger. <laughs> Alright guys, so we got our $10 Milwaukee gun. I mean, it's not supposed to be $10, but you know your boys all about them big deals because it's got... Look at the condition on that thing. <laughs> I mean, bro, it's $10. It's mint. <laughs> Any easels. Um, I got this from Amazon. This actually cost more than my, my tool itself. This was actually $15. Um, it's called a magic eraser. And guys, I used to use Goo Gone and stuff like that to remove all this leftover residue. And let me tell you, that was probably the worst part. Absolute worst part. Every single time is to remove this residue. It took us like Bro, hours. It takes forever. And sometimes you, you nick the paint. Yeah. Because you're getting in there trying to get all of it out. And even even when these you place these emblems, like I I just like you know what honestly let me get this fifteen dollars let me just go ahead and do it and it might change my life and you know what I tried it on the M5 guys and it changes lives get ready. Just like that, look at the difference. <laughs> I mean, you can go ahead and get the rest of this off literally with just a wipe, but it's absolutely insane how much work and time you guys save with this. I'm gonna go ahead and clean off the camera as well. It looks like it got all up in you guys' faces. I'm sorry for that, but man, this tool is worth it. got it pretty much all wiped down bro look how good that looks we've it's... never gotten it this clean i mean obviously we could go a little bit more and just try to perfect it but honestly we're going to put another wing on it we're going to put more residue on it so it doesn't matter but if you guys want to completely clean it off like look how much of a difference that makes guys literally if you guys want to delete a spoiler this is the tool make sure you get that magic eraser from amazon but anyway, we got our new spoiler here from keys motorsports and again the quality is amazing as ever and it already has a 3m applied so uh bada bing bada bang At this point let's go ahead and heat it up and uh put it on the car i hope it's gonna look good i'm really i'm because i mean it looked really nice with the original atlantis blue spoiler but carbon can't be carbon you know what i mean no so, sir you can't you just can't How's it looking? It looks it looks good. Looks perfect. Let me just see if it's even on both sides. Give me yeah. a second. Like a finger. Perfect. Yeah, finger. Oh, the fitment on this spoiler has it's never been better. Yeah. Looks good. Looks good. Oh, looks awesome. And at this point, guys, we can, oh, buddy. Girl, yeah, look at that. Nation. That looks amazing. We need to clean it up, obviously, but let's go ahead and just heat it down to make sure everything just sticks down properly. I'm going to go ahead and just wipe down everything, use a blower. I'm going to show you guys a cool cinematic of everything once it's on the car, but Guys, I, my smile is just not fading with this car. I'm just so, so, so happy. This looks absolutely amazing. Let's go in again, wipe down everything, use a blower, blow it all off, and then start working on the interior because we've got a lot more carbon. And actually, we got a lot of more carbon on the way. It came with 3M, which is absolutely perfect. I'm just gonna go ahead and lay it around all four of these pieces, and then uh, it should be pretty easy to install it in the car. So again, this is probably very easy, and I'm just too excited, so let's just go ahead and get into it.
fitment, bro. The fitment, bro. Do you see this? Look at that. Looks oh, great. This ain't no G80, but oh my god, guys. That looks great. I need to clean up my fingerprints now. Imagine now the people sitting back here looking at these two carbon seats, bro. Give me this camera real quick, guys. You guys need to look at this. Like, imagine the person sitting back here. I mean, again, this ain't no G80, but I mean, sheesh, these look amazing. Now, for the people actually sitting back here, um, they need to see the carbon behind these seats. So, that, and, you know, if you have any like little kids or anything, um, they need to see the carbon back here. So, let's go ahead and fold down the seats so we can put the carbon behind these seats as well, just for those details because the details matter. How does it look on your side? It looks great. Oh, it looks amazing, bro. Bro, the details matter, guys. Sheesh. A bro, look at it from up here. Hold on, let's do the other side real quick. Guys, this thing's not dying on me. There we go. <laughs> it's gonna another five years, I'm telling you. <laughs> oh, that's gorgeous, bro. That is just so nice. Oh my God! Sheesh! Guys, right. did, did you see it from the top? Oh my, you can actually notice it, bro. You can see it, yeah. Oh my God, the details, bro. Can't really see it on oh camera. Oh my God. They can't? They can't really, see, you can see it on camera. Guys, you can see it way more in person. Oh my God, that looks amazing, dude. Oh my, so this is the thing, so they actually have this exact same kit for the M4s. But honestly, I'm loving the M3s more because if you guys come around over here real quick, just look at the carbon. Like it really, really, really stands out because if you guys have the M4s, obviously you don't have rear doors. Um, but at the same time, it still looks good on the M4s, especially as you pull back the seat for people to get in the back. But on the M3s, like it's just another level. Oh my God. I really wish there was some other kind of carbon we could put back here. I'm gonna try to see if some other company makes another piece that goes over here. I might try to get those, but um, oh man. At this point, guys, let's go ahead and get the M3 outside, show you guys the beautiful Atlantis Blue with the new carbon, boys. And yeah, guys, now that we're at the end of the video, I mean, oh my God, the carbon's absolutely gorgeous. I hope you guys enjoyed that little skit. Thank you guys so much for supporting the channel. I'm happy that you guys are enjoying this boat as much as I am. I absolutely love this car. It's been a dream come true. Every single day I wake up in the morning and I see it. I'm just like, thank you guys so much because honestly, I wouldn't have this car without you guys. And I'm just so, so, so blessed to be able to drive it. So again, thank you guys so much. If you guys enjoyed the carbon installs, make sure to smash the like button. Let me know what other carbons. Should we do a front lip, side skirts, rear diffuser? I mean, we have to do those but like what else should we do i want to do so much more stuff to this car maybe some interior carbon we definitely need a carbon fiber steering wheel uh we might have to hit up Ozza for that because i really want a carbon fiber steering wheel i'm thinking maybe an extended leather dash maybe heads up display because i don't have that i want to do a couple retrofits maybe some extended leather door panels and maybe some competition seats you never know i'm gonna go ahead and just fully send this build because i absolutely love this car but obviously everything for this car is super expensive when i'm saying extended leather dash these dashboards go up to 
$2,000 for just extended leather, just the bare dash, nothing else, not even the glove box, which is an additional thousand, which is part of the extended leather thing. So they're very, very, very expensive, but I really want to do the retrofit. I really want to see how it comes out. And also with this car, guys, I'm going to be trying to do more vlogs. I'm going to be trying to take it out more often, try to do some exhaust coats, probably try to get an exhaust on here and just do a couple things, um, just enjoying the car. Because a lot of you guys also want to see more of the car on the channel, not just installs. And I get that. Like, I love doing installs and putting on new modifications and fixing up cars. But we're going to be enjoying this car for sure because this is an absolute beauty of a build. And again, thank you guys so much. Without further ado, guys, remember to cop some merch if you guys want to be shouting in the next video. Without further ado, I love y'all so much. Remember to stay humble. I'll see you guys in the next one. Peace out.